Hey everyone! So today I'm finally back. I've decided to film another video. And this little video is for my first advent calendar illustration. It's a time lapse on Procreate of a little mouse named Bogart. I'm thinking of keeping him as a character for all of my advent calendar illustrations that I've been posting on Instagram. And I also have a blog post talking a little bit about it and why I did it and how I come up with my ideas. So I hope you enjoy it and let me know what you think. So, bye! So I sat down on December 1st. I mean, that's when the idea first came to me. I, it t always tends to happen to me. I come up with these ideas like right on the spot, right when it's happening. I really wish I could organize it better. So I grabbed my iPad and I just started doodling. I didn't quite know what I wanted. I just used, um, I think it's just the, from the original brushes on Procreate, the pencil from sketching. And I just started drawing this little mouse. I knew I wanted it to be in square format for Instagram. <clears throat> because I wanted these for the advent to have a particular feel and look. I wanted them all to be square and since there are three columns in Instagram, I wanted the first three to be of the same color black background, but more I didn't know. So I just first started with the pencil and then I changed to blue ink and then I created the fire. It wouldn't, and when I was creating the fire, it was just very loose, very free. I was using one of the Max Pack um, marker brushes, which I really enjoyed. I absolutely loved it. I really, really loved how it looked when I was layering the light blue and the and the vivid red, uh, crimson red, you could say, for the fire. And then I was just playing around. For this one, I didn't really have a lot of expectations. It was more of just fun and free and letting go. And it didn't have to be the best. I just wanted to create something without having to look at references and proportions. And I just wanted to freely draw something cute for the advent time. And once I was done drawing the mouse and the stocking in the fireplace, I realized that I needed some type of border for like surrounding the mouse in the fireplace because the fireplace is quite dull, it's just white. There's nothing else on there because I wanted the focus to be on the mouse with the large stocking and the fire because the fire really grabs your eye because of the colors and the texture because they're so different to everything else. So I drew a little garland of leaves with some berries and I was very happy with it. I mean, it looked very simple to me. I was doing it quickly on December second actually it wasn't December 1st it was December 2nd and I still wanted to do December 2nd as well so that the next day I could then be on track and do December 3rd so it, this one was a really quick one like a nice little intro I'm guessing that as the days go by it'll progress more and become more maybe more detailed or more complex and as I've already seen already three days in, I've noticed that the mouse has changed quite a lot. <clears throat> and that's okay. <laughs> I mean, this is a learning process and I'm showing it to you. Um, so you can see how art can transform if you do it every day. And since this is not my area of expertise, I'm more into more holistic, um, style you could say more proportional I don't do a lot of cute little illustrations even though I love them I absolutely love them there are a lot of artists that I follow on Instagram and YouTube that I love that style and so I really wanted to try to get into it and here I was trying to add something on the bottom but then I thought no I don't really like how it looks I added the calendar and every day I would be adding the date on the calendar and I wanted the calendar to always look the same and then I just added sissy prints in advent 2018 and that was it and then I had a little bit of texture with this um, and that was it so I hope you guys enjoyed this and check out my next video that I'll be posting shortly thanks for coming by guys bye